सो नाउ लेट स्टार्ट विथ ए टी सी ए टी सी सी डी एंड वॉट इज ए टी सी सी ई ऑल दिस सी सेक्शन लेट्स कंप्लीट द सी सेक्शन फर्स्ट दिस वॉज मिसेलिनियस एंड स्मॉल सेक्शन दैट वोट मच ट्रबल यू आई थिंक ए टी सी सर्टन इन्वेस्टमेंट वॉज ऑल्सो नॉट अ ट्रबल फॉर यू आफ्टर द आइक्रॉनिम यूनिट्स लेफ्ट राइट पी एम जस्ट रिमेंबर द क्यूब्स एंड द स्क्वेयर वेयर एंड वेयर टू पुट इट दैट विल हेल्प यू सो वी हैव डन विद दैट a mac okay so we have done atc we have completed atc there is this section atc maximum deduction of about 3 lakhs of, of about 3 sorry of about 3 is rupees 1 lakh 51 but before this section in atc that i have not thought you all please listen the entire investment the entire investment limit is 1 lakh 50000 only up to 1 lakh 50000 investment under section atc are allowed not above that c it is written over here atc maximum 1 lakh 50000 and this atc c is total of all the three that is atc atc c c and atc c d but before that it is the the atc itself is saying only up to rupees 1 lakh 50000 will allowed as a deduction so let's move ahead now start with atc please write this under where you have written all this atc section take a new page if it is completing over like this how i have completed then take a new page and write atc what is atc contribution to certain pension scheme that is already written in the index so if you want take a pencil and just take over atc and i think almost at least half half you have learnt at least half of the atc is subheads you have learnt if not please listen the video again and it might help you either do one thing you all learn the atc first and after that once listen to all the section at the end of the chapter what i'll do i'll do a rapid revision of entire atc and that video will be of at least 10 to 15 minutes that video you all carry it with you all because within 15 minutes or 10 minutes i'll continuously speak all the section and all the deduction whichever will come under it and it will help you at as an end movement revision because atc if you read before going in the exam hall it will definitely create a problem to her and you might do a silly mistake and come so i just want when you are traveling to go to the center just put a headphone and listen to this it will help you you don't need to read if you constantly read at least before the exam at least half an hour before the exam do not study anything and please reach the center appropriately 15 minutes ahead if you reach there at least half an hour ahead then don't go in the center because the students around you all might ask you certain questions that might confuse you all and the entire concept that i have thought or any of the professors have thought you all you might tend to forget so better don't listen to whatever they are saying either put a headphone if you are put if you put an headphone and any of your friend came and say what are you doing you are not studying he might make you fall in a panicking situation so better appropriately 15 minutes before you go up in the center in directly in the class and sit for the paper and take the paper 15 minutes ahead uh, they provide the service of the question paper 15 minutes ahead and re read the question paper and that's it don't listen after paper you do whatever you want you discuss you don't discuss that is all up to you that doesn't harm the students mentality as far as i have seen but before paper it definitely harms don't do that mistake because it has done me harm many a times i'll tell you one incident uh, at the end of this video atccc contribution to cent certain pension scheme if ssc deposit in a pension scheme pension plan annuity plan etc with lic or any other for receiving pension he is eligible for deduction i think it is quite self explanatory the deduction under this section is maximum up to rupees 1 lakh maximum up to 1 lakh means if he has invested rupees 90000 or the 90000 and but maximum deduction is 1 lakh then he'll get only 90 90000 only not 1 lakh we'll say it maximum 1 lakh so direct you'll put 1 lakh and deduct it it is not like that <laughs> don't do that mistake it is the amount or the maximum deduction whichever is low same in the case of atc also i hope this much is clear it is quite self explanatory please write that atc
I hope ATC is written. We'll start with ATCCD. Notified pension funds by central government. Notified pension funds by central government. If employed, if the SSC is employed, this is a fund. It is a fund. It is we have to invest in it. It is a fund. If the SSC is employed, an employee means the SSC himself is contributing in this fund, then he'll get deduction under section 80 CCD maximum of 10% of his salary. Salary means basic salary plus DNS allowances recognized. R means recognized. What does recognize means? Recognize means that actually he has received. He has received in his hands DNS allowances. Okay, actually received, not the book entry, actually received. So basic salary plus DRNs allowances, 10% or whether he is, whether the employer has contributed then similar to employees contribution deduction under section ATC maximum 10% salary is allowed as a deduction. I hope this much is clear. Make a tree, make a tree like this, how I have made, write the employed one first. I've given you time, please pause it and do. I hope you have done. If the SSE is a self-employed means he is a businessman. Self-employed means a businessman or a firm holder. Or he is a profession, professional person. Then maximum 10% of AGTI. What does AGTI means? First understand that. AGTI means annual gross total income. What does annual gross total income means? So let's go ahead. The income statement. C. Income statement, gross total income, this is also known as annual gross total income, AGTI. Before doing less deduction under section chapter 6A, if you remember capital gain chapter, we have learned long term capital gain, we can't take over here because this is all be calculated on a slab rate. We will, what we'll do, we'll write this all total income, then we'll make a tree. If you remember, we'll make a tree under that tree. We'll, we'll take long term capital gain first, fair, then we'll take short term capital gain under section triple one A. If you remember equity shares one at the rate of 15% short term capital gain. If we take it from the recognized stock exchange, I hope you are remembering. If you have listened to my capital gain lecture, I have left quite few sections that are too, few, few, pro, few formats are remaining that is our miscellaneous uh, miscellaneous one that do not come in exam as per my experience and paper analysis but still i'll teach you for your for your satisfaction that i have taught you all everything so gross total income less i have showed you the tree but for time being that tree i'll teach you when i'll teach you the gross calculation of the total income of the associate is not right now it will come in business and profession and the calculation of total income so you have to first deduct long term capital gain less short term capital gain under section triple one a because there is already a flat rate given at the rate of 20% for long term capital gain for the short term capital gain at the rate of 15% under triple one a section after that whatever the amount come is annual gross total income annual gross total income the this is also known as annual gross total income that is also known as annual gross total income but for time being you write it as an for an what we say presentation gross total income then less long term capital gain less short term capital gain you will get annual gross total income that is AGTI then at the AGTI whatever the AGTI comes say suppose 10 lakh 15 lakh at the rate of 10% will be the amount of self employed deduction you will get that much deduction it is irrespectively of whatever you pay it is not so amount that you have invested maximum whichever is lower will be allowed as deduction maximum of one lakh there is also a limit maximum of one lakh so if you have the agti comes to rupees already it comes to rupees 15 lakhs and 10 percent comes to one lakh fifty thousand but maximum of one lakh is allowed and you have paid is two lakh so whichever is lower that is one lakh will be allowed okay you have understood if you want you can write this the section 80 ccd is completed please pause the video and copy i hope you have done so 
Now the main part comes. ATCCE maximum limit for deduction. ATC plus AT triple C AT CCD. All this together, club together, maximum of one left. That is while calculating deduction, you will write less deduction under chapter 6A. ATC suppose one lakh. ATCCC fifty thousand. Already it reached one lakh fifty thousand. ATCCD again fifty thousand. That come to total two lakh. In the inner column, write two lakh. And after that, write ATCCE. ATCCE maximum deduction of ATC plus ATCCC plus ATCCD is one lakh fifty thousand. So irrespective of two lakh rupees, the the amount of investment in a certain investment and in pension scheme and notify pension funds the maximum deduction under atcce will be allowed is rupees 150000 i hope this much is clear please copy it down i hope this is over all atcs are over for you all so you have completed atc it's an achievement so over our next video will be on other sections